Hi there, James here, founder and director at 5starcables.com. In this video I'm going to explain to you about how you can extend or replace your existing Virgin Media cable very quickly and easily without having to contact Virgin to send out an engineer. So what often happens in many households is you may have your super hub box, your TiVo box or your V6 box maybe sitting somewhere in your living room and you might be redecorating for example and you perhaps want to be able to move one of these units to perhaps some part of the room or perhaps somewhere else in the house. What would often happen is you contact Virgin and they'll say yes we can send out an engineer, it'll take three to four weeks and it'll cost about £120, thank you very much. So what we do here at Five Star Cables is we provide you the cable so you can simply and easily extend or replace the cable yourself uh, and we provide that to you there. So I'll show you what, how we typically, how we can do that. So if you've got a Virgin Super Hub box, uh, you see on the back here, what you have is the, the coaxial cable going into the back of the unit and this is a uh, 6.1mm F connection, that's currently what uh, Virgin Media use. But we want about to say, reposition this somewhere perhaps in the other room, maybe somewhere else. So all we simply do is you simply unscrew it on the back here. So you've got a male connection. Oh, just a little bit tight there. Just get that undone. And then it's off and you can see the F connection there, so it's the female input and that's the male connector. And then what we do is we will then send you the replacement extension cable. So one end replicates what's actually on the back of the, the box there for the super hub. So that's the female F connection. And all you do is you take out that, reattach it on the back there, screw it on, just make sure it's nice and tight and snug. Okay, and then you reattach the back of it again onto the back of the router. And again, just make sure the pin's straight and just give it a nice tight. And you might have to just turn the router on and off just to reset the signal. And then what happens is once you've done that and it's on, You've then got an extra, in this example, five meters to play with and you can reposition it there. And you, it, as you can see, I've just literally done that myself in just a few moments. With the TiVo box, it's exactly the same. So on the back of the TiVo box, again, you've got your cable that will be connected onto the back here. So you've got your input there, again, on the F connection. So I'm just going to screw it up. I've done it on nice and tightly. And there you've got your F connection. And what I'll do is I'll then attach it. These are the types of cables that we send you. So again, that's a five meter example. And then reattach it there to the joining coupler. If you don't want the joining coupler, you can just take that off and you've got mail to mail cable because it's not always necessary. But generally, if you're extending the cable, you'll always need this joining coupler. So you need to just firmly attach that there. Reattach that there for the pins. Screw on, just make sure it's nice and tight. Bum, 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 bum. And then again, reattach this cable that we send you to the back. Just going to screw it on. And then exactly the same like what we did with the super hot box there. You've then got your extra five meters or so to play around with, or 10 meters or whatever length you buy. So it's as quickly and easy as that. With the V6 box, it's slightly different. <clears throat> if you look at the back of the V6 box here, what you notice often Virgin Engineers will put a patch lead here because the connection is different. It's actually an RF inputs rather than an F connection. So we've got the short patch lead here. That's actually coming from your existing line coming into your for your property uh, to the actual adapter here. So all you need to do is just keep the adapter on there. Don't touch it at all, just leave it as it is. And then we send you the V6 version cable, which is a male RF to female RF cable. And all you do is just attach the female end to the one you've just unplugged. Attach it there, just push it in. And then just reattach the back there again. So it's just a bit slightly different on the V6 box compared to the other two units. But then again, in this example, you've then got an extra five meters to play around with. And again, just reset the equipment and reset everything for you. Simple as that, basically. So what we do here um, at Five Star Cables is we send out the cables very quickly. So it's all free shipping to our UK customers. We also provide the cables with wall clips as well. So we do one of those per metre. So it just helps going on sort of skirting boards. So you can just tack it and kind of go along there. If you want the colour to be different 
to select from the drop down, we can set it in black if you wish to do so. Normally the preference is white because most people have that going internally in actually in your property. But if you want to run it externally, you can do so. Just select from the drop down and select black rather than the default white. Um, people tend to run that on brickwork outside because it's not as exposed as the, the white would be. But we can send it to you in black or either of the cable types there as well. Um, if you do have a splitter, um, it's exactly the same. You see the connections are exactly the same. So it's just a case of extending it from there or from there. That would be the line coming into your property. And then one might be typically going to your, your super hub box and then one might be going to your TiVo. But again, that's the exact same cable there. To simply attach and extend. Um, yeah, so in regards to this, there's, there's no loss of uh, speed or quality of the, the video picture. It's all exactly the same. Uh, we've never had any issues at all with that. Um, apart from that, that's, that's pretty much it, guys, really. If you've got any questions, please feel free to, to contact me. Um, you can order from the, the items below or above on this, this web, web page. Um, if you've got any questions, feel free to contact me, but please like and subscribe to my channel. Thanks for watching. Take care. James, bye.